Hey, what is up guys? Bayleaf here, and today I am going to be reacting to the new Ruby episode. So it's Ruby Volume 3, Chapter 1, Round 1. Um, I'm just going to dive into this. I haven't seen it yet, so it should be interesting. I'll probably talk about it more after. So let's just get right into it. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Wow, that is loud. It should be better. This looks a lot better than last season. This is nice. Oh, this is like the scene from the intro to um, the first season. It's her mother's grave. Hey, Mom. Sorry I haven't come by that, in a that's while. That's really sweet. Things have been... Well, things have been pretty busy. Oh, Dad's here, too. He's, uh, you know... Do we ever get to see her Dad. father? Because he's still teaching at Signal, but he told me he's going to be going out on some mission man. soon. <laughs> I think he misses adventuring with you. It's hilarious. I miss you, too. This is a dog in the mouth. Haven't gotten Yay, kicked out of Beacon getting yet. Kicked out of school. So Sand that's cool. school, school kids. I think being on a team with Yang helps. <laughs> I keep her in line. Yeah, click. That was a joke. She's actually a really great fighter. You can tell she's learned a lot from Dad. They're good too. Well, so are Weiss and Blake. Oh, Blake's definitely they're my the best. Together, we form Team Ruby. And yes, before you ask, that <laughs> does cause a lot of confusion. That's amazing, I love it. Anyways, uh, I made a bunch of new friends, and I met some, uh, let's just say, odd teachers. This is the perfect way oh, to open up to the new season. It's just too. like, a callback like to everything say, that's already happened. That's like mother, really like good, daughter. especially after such a long break. I still wonder why Ozpin let me into the school early. But, uh, yeah, I guess he'll tell me one day. You know how he is. It's funny, the more I get to know him, the more he starts sounding like Uncle Crow. Almost forgot the hat. Oh, looks like Dad's back. I gotta go. He's dropping me off at Beacon for the tournament match before he goes oh, on his next mission. Oh, Does he Wish speak? me luck! Does he have lines? Say something. It was good to talk. Say something. Say something. Not. Oh my god, Narita. Pretty ears. I love the fondness. Oh god. And yes, Peter, I think people. it's safe to say Suppose. this match may be one of the closest we've seen in the four no four round of the tournament. For those of you just now joining us, welcome to the final festival tournament. Broadcast live from the MSA. Oh, it's floating. Oh, I saw that in the uh, World of Remnant episode. Cool. Context. It's important, kids. If this is your first time watching, allow us to break down the rules. The tournament is divided into three distinctive rounds. Teams, doubles, and singles. Age and school year are irrelevant. In this tournament, the only attribute being tested... Skill. ...is skill. Correct. <laughs> the winners of this battle will elect two of their members to represent them in the doubles round, followed by the winners of that round choosing one member to advance once again. The remaining combatants will then fight their way through the final bracket so in the hope down. of achieving victory for their kingdom. I have to admit, I'm curious to see some fights. Awesome Maybe we'll get to see all this weapon. On which to spectate on. And I don't think anyone tuning in around the world is going to disagree with me on that. Uh, and why would they? Now, let's get oh, back to the match there. between Team Ruby of Beacon and Team Auburn of Haven. <laughs>
yours. Ah, wise. Oh, the animation for glyphs is in That's not even like that. No. worked up an appetite gee if only there was somewhere on campus yeah, to get food around here <laughs> oh wait it's okay Weiss I forget about the fairgrounds too I was being facetious well if you were hungry why didn't you say so come on I know just the place where that place be? Oh, where dad's going why does she have to go to the communication house? Hey! Talk to might be hard to eat without this. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> that chick? Good to see you, Ruby. Damn. Oh, thanks, Emerald. Oh, guess I dropped it. Oh, girl pockets are the worst. What's up, Em? Just left the stadium after <laughs> watching your amazing fight. You guys were awesome. Oh, stop it. Shut your stupid I heard your team progressed the next round, too. You know, I feel like we never see our other teammates. Yes. How'd they do in the fight? Oh, gosh, that's so She's nice really of you, but that just my teammates people. are all kind of introverted. What? Uh, really socially awkward. Why did... Ooh, yeah. I could see that. So, yeah, no looks like Merc and I are going to be moving on to the doubles round. What about you guys? No well, comment. as the leader Never of this mind. team, just I thought long it. and hard about this decision. We put it to a vote. Oh, uh, yes, sir, but I decided that we should put it to a vote. We voted for Weiss and Yang. I will happily represent Weiss Team Yang? Ruby. Yeah, we're going to kick some butt. No way, Blake and Ruby all the way. <laughs> well, if Mercury and I see you down the line, don't think we'll go easy on you. <laughs> Wouldn't have it any other way. All right, well, we're going to go catch some more fights. Have fun! Um, 
See you later. So how are the new friends? Huh. I hate them. I orders hate them. are just orders. I just up. how can they be so happy like all this. the time? Did you at least get what we want? It's the heiress and the bimbo. Hmm. All right. At least now we know who we're working with. The heiress and the bimbo. Huh. With Tiffany Harris, what? Yang? I'll have a bowl of the regular, please. Holy mother of God. Ooh. I'll take the same. Holy mother of God. Hmm. Do you have anything with the low salt? Uh, um, okay. <laughs> of course. <laughs> oh, Why? this was the occasion. Considerate thanks for sending me to the doubles round. <clears throat> what? How can my card be my father was calling. I was barely into my monthly allowance. Oh, no. Maybe I could help. Uh, yeah. Aw, you don't have Here's to. Loaded. But she could. Well, I think you all earned it after that battle. Mind if we join you? Oh my god, is Nora, just are you sure it's wise to have a war fight? Of course, it will give us energy. Uh, war for the I win. Barf, I'm blaming you. Oh, aim at the enemy. So I was trying Nora. to do that's disgusting. But if you do feel the urge, got it. Well, we thing. should be off. Right. So, you okay. think you guys are ready? Of course! We've got a world-renowned fighter on our team. What's basically a ninja. I can bench five of me. John! We've trained all year. Wow, our weapons Nora's are strong. awesome. Glinda barely yells at us anymore. And, uh... She benched five of herself. John! Are you gonna take that? She's not wrong. <laughs> no, no, she is I'm not. I'm kidding. <laughs> he knows I'm kidding. Don't be so nervous. The worst that could happen is we lose. Then it's just a few more years of walking around school with everyone knowing we're failures. Our friends will slowly abandon us to preserve their social status. We won't be able to show our faces in class. No one will sit with us in the cafeteria. Fred and I have no parents. We have no home left to go to. Yeah, we'll parents. be a family every day. Team Lucifer! <laughs> Oh, yeah. that, <laughs> We're feeling pretty good. Don't fret. If anything, we should be looking forward to a fight with actual guidelines and not, well, murderers. Yeah, don't sweat it. We've all faced way worse before. Let's see. Grim invasions, violent extremists, a destructive sociopath. And that's all while we were still in training. Oh, imagine what it'll be like when we graduate. Maybe then I'll be able to pay for a meal. <laughs> I wonder if I just make it my... Yes, like they were scheduled to several minutes ago. Well, it looks like this is it. They have to fight on full stomachs like that. Go get him! <laughs> I think my name's not making it to the class unless Kira can carry the team. Which she probably can. This for the people? We... This should be a fight with Sam. I don't know which one should be <laughs> As if we didn't already know. Oh, come oh, no, on. Even if you know how a story ends, that doesn't make it any less fun to watch. She spot the popcorn from the time lesson. Team Juniper of Beacons versus Team Bronze of Shade. <laughs> Oh, turning this out to the environment. That is awesome. That is really neat. Forest.
Son of a bitch. feel about the new animation. It might get better over the seasons. I might grow to like it. I'm not sure. But so far, it's, uh, it's just got a lot less of a wow factor than in the previous seasons. Although it's so good, and it still carries the story, and I'm sure the story and stuff will still be great and the characters, but the fight scenes do a lot for me, and if they're going to be like that, it will decrease the overall value of the show, but it's still going to be great, because, you know, we got the characters are amazing, the story is amazing, the world building is phenomenal, the Matrix teeth, so, you know, there's that. But, yeah, we'll see how it grows over the course of the season, and how well it does. Um, the fight scene was pretty decent. It was well choreographed. It was interesting to see some other fighters from the other towns, well, cities, whatever, the other places in Remnant. What do they call them? The other kingdoms, that's it. The other kingdoms. Seeing people from the other kingdoms, it was interesting. They had some different weapons, some new weapons. The thing, the only thing that actually struck me as that cool was definitely the skateboard pistols. That was pretty awesome. I'm not even a skateboarder, but my brother was, so he's dead. Um, it was pretty awesome. Um, There's not much else to say about this episode, except I'm really hoping to see that fight against Team Juniper and Team Bronze, I think it was. that That's going to be pretty good. I think John's either going to get his ass kicked or reveal some sort of new semblance. Although, judging by how Nora was talking about them and Pierre was defending him, I don't think he's gotten that much better as a fighter. Although, he might have improved as a leader, which can still be extremely beneficial. We'll see. Um, starting to get a little into this. I don't want to make this video too long, so... Yeah, I don't have much more to say on that, except I enjoyed the video. It wasn't as good as the first or second season, but it's definitely, it was nice to see some of the new stuff, some of the new weapons, some of the new people, even if they're only background characters and just for this episode. It was still pretty cool. So, we'll see what they do with it and how it goes. Um, I'm sure it's going to be very different now that they don't have their lead writer, so we'll, we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna end it at like exactly 20 seconds because I'm cool like that and I'm not that same. Alright, this has been Baybrony9514, Carpe Diem. Um, subscribe for more Red vs. Blue. Uh, well, I might start doing Red vs. Blue. Sorry, no, not Red vs. Blue. Subscribe for more Ruby, some more Fallout 4, and some more MLP content. I will see you later. Hat tip, Carpe Diem. See you later.